Hey gang, and welcome to the Stamp and Scoop show, episode 39, take two. Sorry for the yeah. additional sound there. Uh, we were having some te technical difficulties. You just never got to see take yeah. one. <laughs> take one just didn't take off. We don't know what happened, but it, it just didn't start. Oh, God. So um, hopefully you guys can see us now. Um, anytime that happens, I always go back to our main Facebook page and we will pin the new video up to the top because in a technical world, Is that what you did? stuff happens. Yep. Just pin it right Hold to the top. On. So Linda's going I'm and, learning um, things here. Hold on. Save video, unfollow. I don't want to unfollow. Oh my goodness. I don't know what just happened. Okay. So anyways, <laughs> while we're getting days. that all and trying to get you guys back onto the new video feed, um, we have a very exciting episode. This is episode <gasps> 39. We are going to be sharing the um, painted autumn. Like painted <laughs> autumn suite um, that's in the new holiday catalog. It is Awesome. Oh my awesome. gosh. Wait till you guys see what Linda has done for you. You're going to flip. You're, you, you, all right. Let's just say you are going to get this stamp set and pull every color of ink out that you have because I have shown you how to put them all together and make gorgeous flowers. Oh my God. She has the most amazing set of color. It's a color chart. Color she, chart. So it's episode 39. She has almost 30. 30. I think we counted almost 30 yeah. different color combinations going. for this beautiful sunflower. <laughs> we have, I think we counted 39 samples to show you. Yeah. And Linda's going to make a card. I am. So we have so much to share with you guys. While you're popping on, we are going to show you what Ooh. we're giving away. So we went through the unclaimed. My band of hands again. <laughs> unclaimed prize oh, the bolt, lovely. Um, and we have so much stuff to give away here. Um, this is um, uh, amazing. Um, so Where this is starting? what happens. You have two weeks to claim a prize if you win a prize live um, on my online videos or on the Stampin' Scoop show. If you don't claim it within two weeks, it goes back In into the <laughs> vault. And we've opened the vault. We've opened the vault. <laughs> and everybody gets to take advantage of all of these prizes that Look were unclaimed. This. Yeah, there's two paper pumpkin bundles. So the bundles are actually the paper oh. pumpkin. There's a July and there's a May paper pumpkin kit. And the bag. And the tote bag that goes oh. with them. So that's a bundle. Nice. We're going to give those away. We've got Look three hostess this. stamp sets. <gasps> yep. Or two hostess that's stamp a, sets and a, a, and a regular a, a regular that's set. Live. You can buy that now. Nice. The All Happy Day card kit. <gasps> Look at this. Yep. Sealed in a box. Sealed oh, in a yeah. box. Tammy and I have not played with this one. <laughs> and um, our after live today is the Carols of move Christmas. Let it so you can actually see it's, it. it. And it's the bundle. that The reason yep. why that um, yep. there we go. elastic there is because it comes with a die yep. set too. So that's a huge bundle. So Ooh. in order to enter this, all you need to do is leave a comment here on this video. So all of everything except the Carols of Christmas will be live drawings. Yes. If you are watching this live on Facebook, on Linda's channel, or on mine, we broadcast simultaneously. When it's working. Yeah, when it works. <laughs> when it works, which is 50% of the time. Yep. <laughs> we get lucky. If you think we know what we're doing, we don't. No, we fake it. <laughs> we really it. don't. Yep. So just so, yeah, it's just to, again, if, if any technical difficulties ever happen in the future, always go right back to our main Facebook page. Yeah, it'll show up. And th this is live on Facebook. If you're on YouTube, I get this question a lot. They're like, how oh. come I keep missing you live on YouTube? It's because we're no, not, no, live, not on live on YouTube. YouTube. We're not there yet. No. We haven't figured out how to do it all yet. But we are live yep. on Facebook right now, simultaneously on Linda's Crafty Stampin' Channel. We haven't necessarily Stampin figured that out either. And on my Stamp with Tammy, and that's with the number one after um, Facebook page. Yes. Both of our Facebook yes. pages at the same time. You can leave a comment on um, either both. video, yes. and you will be entered to win. Um, now, the, the difference between the live and the after live is the live we're going to do at the end of this episode. So if you're watching this live on Facebook, yeah. boom, you will be entered if you leave a comment <laughs> on either one of those channels. You can, leave, you can be, win one of, one of these prizes. Now... If you are watching, if you if you missed the live or you didn't win a live, you have the opportunity to to win our after live, which is the Carols of Christmas bundle. And um, so, all you need to do to enter to win that is leave Stop. a comment. Too many things down there. I'm getting messed I up. I know we have too many prizes to give away. <laughs> and um, it, you can actually double your entry into the double after your live drawing, <laughs> right? Like double mint gum. <laughs> By sharing this video and typing the word shared in the comments. You With can, a D. You can do that on YouTube or Facebook because yes. this will be uploaded into YouTube later. <laughs> so that is explaining how our, our giveaways work. <laughs> now we are giving away our after live from our episode 38, our last episode. Um, we had ready the for Ready for Christmas bundle. Love this. Brand new in the new holiday catalog. That was yes. our ho the, holiday catalog extraordinary doggy. episode. 
Oh yes. my God, on the staircase. So, so cute. cute. So stinking cute. So, we have taken all of the comments that were left so on both many. of our YouTube channels and on both of our Facebook channels yep. and condensed them so everybody has one entry unless you share to the broadcast. Then you get onto Facebook and type shared and then you will see, and we're going to pop on over there, you will see that you have been entered twice. So here's all the entries and I'm going to scan through here real fast and hopefully you'll see your name. But if you see people twice, <laughs> it's because they shared and we love to share the love. We love to give it right back to you guys. Yes, As thank you. can you. see with all these prizes. My goodness, yes. We wouldn't be here without you. We love you guys. We do this all for you, just so you know. Like Linda has like, what do you see? Her <laughs> her color charts that she did for you guys. Yes. Over the yes. top. So I hope that I hope that you guys love and use all the resources that we have for you. Okay, so ready? I am going to hit randomize. And when I do, whoever's on top is going to be the winner. Ready, set, and good luck, everybody. Yay! All right. Angie McKenzie is the winner of our After Live from episode 38. And um, in order to claim your prize, you'll just want to pop on over to the um, the winners. That There's a... a I'm drawing a blank. Prize claim form. Thank you. On, the, <laughs> on, the, on, on my blog, it's on the winner's page, but uh, Linda might have her set up a little it's bit differently. Little different. Yep. Anyways, there's a link in this um, video's description to that prize claim form. Fill it out, and we will get this right off to you. There you go. Okay, now we are ready to get started. Wow. We have so much to share with you guys. This bundle is amazing, and it has definitely been the most popular in the the new holiday catalog. i actually got one order the other day that didn't have it on there Stop i it. actually want to call her up and go you made a mistake because <laughs> everyone else has bought this you must you must have done something you must right. have overlooked it let me let me help correct you <laughs> It really has been such a popular item. So because so many of you have ordered it and so many of you have it on your wish list, I hope that you appreciate all that is coming at your way right now. I love this. So you can find this on in the holiday catalog on pages 48 and 49. Some beautiful little samples. And here is what is made up in this suite. So let me show you... Um, straight on here. I'll move my catalog out of the way. So the big deal in this is the stamp set. This is a painted harvest stamp set and it has, you know, our traditional two step stamping, but it is these pieces that make up the, I want to say Daisy, not Daisy, sunflower. sunflower. That just, although it doesn't have to be it a doesn't, sunflower. No, the beautiful no. thing about this, it's a watercolored image look that yeah. really could be. You can go in. I did make a wreath out of it. Yeah, so you can you see could. what you can do. But it just has this realistic look. It is just, just amazing. This is where we're going to show you all the color samples. But we have, so we have the stamp set. Also is the burlap ribbon is in this suite. And this is in our annual catalog. And it just, it has a great fall feel. So that is in addition to this. We also have our leaf punch. This is part of a bundle. So this is the bundle in the uh, suite. And when you order the two together, you get the 10% off. So yeah, that is Brown says this deal. is her all-time favorite it, set. It is. And I, I saved the little bit of the last. Okay. The, 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 the best girl. part about this is this is a brand new pack Bro, of designer it is, paper. And it I've is. already been through two or three packs of this designer paper. That's how much I love we it. We had it to order a new first. one because both it's of us didn't have full I know. Sheets. I had to order a new pack so we could show you guys. And it's still sealed. Okay. Ready? So we get to sniff it. And come over here and sniff, Ready, set. Ooh, new paper <sighs> smell. There's, there's nothing better than that new paper smell. Who says a new car smell is good? They haven't it smelled paper. Yeah, right, I like these. the new car smell too, but something about that designer paper. I don't and know it's what so it much is. cheaper to get the newspaper smell than the new car yeah. smell. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's. I'm gonna go through these kind of quickly because you want to see all the different. Yeah, you samples. totally want to see. So this here are some of the beautiful watercolor images. The colors in this kit are just so yummy and fall. Very and fall. You just, you want to put on a sweater while you're working on this. <laughs> I'm ready for sweater season. I, I am I too. am. Here in New England, it's it's so it, beautiful. And is. fall is my favorite time of year. And it's I'm just ready. always so pretty here out in New England. I felt like, you know, we didn't get that much of a, a summer. And maybe it's yeah. just because I was traveling for a big chunk of it. It was very cool here it, in, but, in Yeah, Northeast. but I'm still ready for fall. It's my Look favorite season. And so this really represents okay. fall to me. And All I, right. You need to buy it just for this paper here. I like. I want a wallpaper or something with this. I, I know, right? How that. fun is that? And that Isn't is a beautiful that gorgeous on it. So so pretty. So that's the paper on high speed. But wait till we show you <laughs> the other stuff. Here, let me hand this to you so we don't here, yeah. have I anything will take care go of wrong. That. All right. Yeah, it's so already been one of those days where everything <laughs> seems to be going wrong. 
Okay. But nothing can go wrong when you're stamping because you no. can always correct it. Okay, so There's what I did was I put these like in color groups. We may not be able to go live on Facebook easily. We may have a lot of trouble <laughs> with that. But when it comes to stamping, even if we mess it up, it's still a good day. Still looks good. So these so are here comes the, the color greens combos. that I'm going to call it. And I'm going to come go through these kind of fast because we got a lot to get through. These are going to be on both Tammy and my blogs, craftystampin.com and stampwithtammy.com um, after the show, like in about, I'd say an hour to two hours, yeah, depending on how our, days, get them up after the, our day after is going. Live. So you will yeah. be able to save these. You'll be able to uh, screen, you know, Enlarge them so you can see everything here. But here's some samples like Lemon Lime Twist and Old Olive, Pool Party and Tranquil Tide, Wild Wasabi and Emerald Envy. I mean, just the uh, combos that you can do are awesome. So here is, these are what I'm calling the oranges and yellows. Um, we got some uh, peekaboo uh, peach. There's saffron curry. Oh, I love these. You know, for all of these, I've pretty much stuck with three centers. That being crushed curry, soft suede, and chocolate chip. To me, they seem to be the best colors for any of the centers. Um, but it's just uber, uber and, yummy. And I love the different looks that you have going on there. I mean, yeah. It's just such a great, and you great can combo. So you can match it really to anything. And I swear, once you get going, you're like, I wonder you, what will happen. <laughs> but I put these colors together. Because I will tell you, there's colors here I never would put together um, any other ways. And those are some of those are right here. Here I have Melon Mambo and Real Red. I think I would keep those two as far away from each other as possible <laughs> unless I had game, right? a overflowing Valentine's Day car going on. But here it just adds so much. I just love the pinks. I have to say, these are kind of my favorites. The Blushing Bride with Floaty Flamingo. Oh, Floody Linda, Flamingo you'll be happy to know that Sean Cullen, your husband, just joined. Hi, Sean. <laughs> Hi, honey. Thanks he's, for joining us. He's home waiting for a package. <laughs> he had to take the day off of work. So, so much work's getting on. He's watching me. Uh, <laughs> Um, here we got real red and cherry cobbler. Like again, two colors I probably wouldn't see. And they together. look fantastic. I love, love, love the 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 daffodil and the and the um, crushed curry and the yeah. and the cobbler together. Oh my gosh, so it's so just pretty. Striking. Okay, and here's purples because I have some of the ladies in my club are crazy purple ladies, and I just have to always have something in purple. And so here we go. Wisteria Wonder and Eggplant with the curry in the middle. It's, it's just Razzleberry gorgeous. Razzleberry and fig. Just gorgeous. Sweet Sugar Plum and Berry Burst. Perfect Plum and Fresh Fig. And then here we have the blues. Like Bermuda Bay and Pool Party beautiful, Pool and beautiful. Indigo. I just, just pull the colors out and start playing. I kept finding things I liked more and more and more. And so and Linda and I will have these color charts up. All up. On our resource page to this episode, again, probably an, an hour after the, yeah. after the live. So, Depends yeah, she's, well aren't those amazing? Goes. Like, seriously, yeah. I'm going to give her a hand. Woo! Okay, so hold on. Now, I'm gonna now pull she's, she's got stamps. dead air. She's ready to start stamping. Nope. So, Here it comes. Just, I can't just, you know, show you all that and then not do something with all of that. So I'm not going to show you my finished card. I'm going to hide that over the side so I can keep an yeah, eye on it. She's mean like it. that. She's just going to make you look at the stamps. I am, I am, I am. Mm -hmm. So one thing I found... So these stamps, this over here. These are our, uh, this whole stamp set is photopolymer only. So um, you, I found, you get the best image when you add our piercing math. Uh, so, <clears throat> and I got one. You can see I wrote stamping only because I have one that I've used with my piercing tool, and it's got all the little pokey holes in it. Oh, that's a great idea you, to have two. Yes, different. you don't want to use that Excellent. one because that will uh, affect your image. You just have one that is stamping only. I take a little bit of copy paper and I put it on she top just to kind of protect it. Awesome ideas today, there isn't she? So you will get much better images out of your um, flowers with this. Any any of your photopolymers will look better this way. So today we I am pulling out. All right, so our center is going to be crushed curry. Our wider, larger um, stamp is going to be peekaboo peach. We're going to do Tangerine Tango, and then I'm going to add our, our greeting, but also a little extra with some soft suede. So let me see if I can get this all in. I'm going to open these all up. Ready to stamp. They just look so pretty, don't they? I know. Look, look, look at the little colors, my little palette. All right, so normally, let me see if I can find my... I hide everything in this little bag so nothing gets like stamped on early and by mistake. All right. So normally when I stamp, 
Um, I will, if I'm going to die cut, I'll stamp and then die cut. But due to Facebook Live and trying to uh, move things along, I have pre cut out. Due to the magic of yes, Facebook. <laughs> an oval with uh, the stitch, the largest oval with the stitched shapes. And I'm going to use, so this is the, of the two, this one's the larger one. So I start with this one. And now, do you think it matters if you start with it. the smaller or the larger? I think if you want, well, if you have two very light and dark and you're using the dark on the smaller one, you definitely want to, you can, you can stamp over it. So it doesn't matter which way you go first, mm -hmm. but if they're both kind of dark and you're looking, you want, I get have to show. <laughs> so like here where you can't see a lot of definition if you, you'll lose the little definition you've got when you come over here and you have something very light like marina and miss i actually stamped three times i stamped to the big one i stamped the smaller one and then i stamped the big one again Ooh. over it to make it a little uh, make it a little fuller so i'll show you, you some behind that. the scene tips now yep so here we go so i like to start with uh the center it's easier for me to start so i'm going to start and because of this card in general, I'm, I'm putting it kind of over here off the side. Now I'm going to, again, back to the big one, and I'm going to start with the peekaboo. And we're praying this works out just fine on live TV. So we'll see. Um, and I'm just eyeballing it through the photopolymer. Hopefully this worked out. There we go. And then I'm taking the smaller one with tangerine tango and again i'm going to line it up kathy says she's taking advantage to not having power at work so she gets oh, a craft day there <laughs> we go off to craft. so there it is so there is lucky girl tangerine on the bottom or oh, sorry peekaboo beach on the bottom and tangerine on the top i can i'm going to see if this works i can take the peach again turn it in a different direction and stamp again and it just adds more to the outside. Oh, so, that's awesome. But if that's that, a great tip. If the difference between the peach and the tangerine were much closer together, it might not work out. But now, all right, I have the little dots that are in. Let me see. Where did I put my face? So you can see it better. We get these little dots here as a stamp set. So I'm going to take that and I'm going to dip it in my soft suede. And I'm just going to randomly oh, stamp so it cute. in the center of the um, sunflower. That is awesome. Just adds a that little bit more. also makes a great background. Just adds a little <laughs> bit more definition. There we go. A couple little dots. Yeah. So now I'm going to take my greeting and I'm stamping it along the bottom over the flower. I totally intend to do that. So there, actually, this came out better than I thought it might. <laughs> so I did bring a couple extras I had pre-stamped, just in case. All right, so now I can hide those over here. So let's move that, there, we'll move that to the side and move my blocks over. I'm going to close these up so I don't end up wearing them because we all know how that goes. And Patty says they're just getting some power back on in Florida. Uh, our heart's out to you guys. Yes, I know. I'm so, so many yeah, so grateful that you are, you are able to get back on now as opposed to a month from now when right. we have so much more happening. We, right. we're, we're glad that that kind of came through. Right. So here's and my, it's gone. Bad yeah. Irma. Agreed. <laughs> Bad Irma. So here is, so I get my base is crumb cake. And I'm using this brown piece from the... Um, the paper, uh, painted autumn, painted autumn, painted autumn. The There's too many painted paper. autumns and harvests. Painted autumn. I know. I get confused. I keep saying the wrong yep. names. So I'm gonna just between the painted harvest and the painted uh, autumn. autumn. Yeah. I'm like, which one's which? Which one's? So now I'm gonna put the vellum over this, and this is gonna end up like around here. So this is where I'm gonna add my adhesive because I know it's gonna get covered. Uh, there we go. So now, Sue so says she just up. convinced her she wasn't going to get this oh. set. And <laughs> now it's See? a must have. You're probably the only one. I know, I was to say. Get, so. <laughs> All right. So now I have. I actually think I have two sets of these. <laughs> and Veronica's using one, and I have one here. Okay. So where am I going? This is going to make this the bottom. So now I'm going to add my detail. 
and I'm going to add this to this. So I'm adding Soft Sky and Cajun Craze to a little bit of a strip under my DSP. I don't like that. Can you see that? And now let's we'll see if this fits in my banner. It may not. I'm going to have to do this by hand. So I got my triple banner punch and try and make that work. Let's see. Yeah, that worked out. So now I'm going to put this here. Don't you want to put anything under it? No. I have to remind myself what I what I did or what do I intend to do. Because I'll just go rogue yep. from here. Yeah, she's going rogue on <laughs> her own project. I have done that before. <laughs> Okay, so now I've got the uh, burlap ribbon. Let me see, I got a little, there we go. Add a little fast fuse to hold that nice and tight. And where's my snips? <laughs> Never mind the stamp set. Tanya says now she needs to buy vellum. <laughs> uh, I will tell you lately, I have put vellum on more cards. I am absolutely loving and playing Everybody vellum. is giving a shout out on the colors. We got Veronica and yeah. Barbara and Kim oh, and cool. Angela. They're all loving the all loving the colors. It, it It's just so warm and cozy. You want to sit down and have a hot chocolate or a hot cider and, you know, go on an apple picking. Like, Oh, apple picking. I can't wait. Yeah. So, all right. So there I've, I've oops. trash alert going all over right. the place. There we go. All right. So there's my base. And then, oh, okay. I'm trying to remember. What did I do? Barbara right. popped in. She says she's having her craft fix for the day. Oh, uh, there we go. We're so happy to provide. I'm going to use this stripey watercolor piece and I'm using the leaf punch and I'm just going to punch out three of them. So that leaf punch you can purchase with the stamp set for um, a 10% discount on the bundle together. Bargain! Yeah, it is. Yeah. I love punches. All right. One, two, three. So I like doing things in threes. <laughs> Janet says it's so fun to watch you go rogue. <laughs> <laughs> it is. I know. When I go rogue, it never works out well. When Linda goes rogue, it ends up being this amazing art piece Let's of artwork. See. Boom. And. Them. Oops. Oh, I'm sticking to Tammy's table. I have um, a silicone mat there. If you... Eh. Go rogue. Yeah. We'll yeah. Why? Your, your, your back of uh, their, uh, their background will be part of the card. Yeah. I mean, you know, it kind of fits right in there. There with you the, go. It the does. It does. And I will tell you, this entire card pack goes amazing with the wood uh, DSP, too. Oh, you yeah, it does. Bundle it does. up. Gotta some. love that wood textures DSP. Yeah. I just used that last week with yeah. the um, the paper pumpkin kit on yeah, my last right. so online I class. Added a whole bunch of dimensionals Do -do -do. over here, over here. Okay, so we're gonna stick that right there. And you know it's not done yet because. I like oh, bling. Of course not. Of course <laughs> I like not. It's bling. never done until you add the bling. bling. So, uh, let's see. I had a, I had a, I'm going to have to open a new one because I need some of the small ones. So, these are the gold faceted gems. And these are my favorite accessory for fall mm -hmm. because this gold just is yummy for fall. So, we're going to take I'm gonna take a medium. I don't want to use that. Do I have a, my, my application tool is a pokey tool. Oh, excellent. I, I find what a great I idea. Lots of control yeah, with it. Yeah, she's just full of it today, isn't she? <laughs> well, if you don't come away from this with I learning say, at my, least one new thing. I just say, my husband's probably listening, going, yes, she is she's full, full of it, it at yeah, times. She's full yes. Of it. <laughs> but I'm sure I, he's thinking something instead different. Instead of it, I should have said, full of great ideas, <laughs> full of brilliance. There we go. So, uh, stick that right there. So, there we go. Now it's done. It has its bling. And oh, it's awesome. I actually made it look like the one that I had Wow, look at that. She did not go rogue, Janet. Sorry for that. <laughs> almost. So yeah. close. A couple times I almost did it. So that is the card, and anybody can do that. I mean, literally, there. you saw how I double stamped it. You Just can't mess it up. I know. It's beautiful. So every, every way that it's stamped, it's yes. beautiful. And so with that note, <laughs> let's check out some of the different look at I'm, I'm not joking here when i say we have so many different things to share with you guys right now all made with this with this bundle so I'm and again all of this will be on both of yes. our blogs so 
on Later. craftystampin.com and on um, stampwithtammy.com. Stamp Stamp and here's the um, yep. here's the, the URLs if you need them. But they are also um, in the link of the video description right now. So um, what I'm showing you right now is the first of almost 30, I think 39 or very close to 39 yeah. to go with episode There's 39 <laughs> of um, the Painted Autumn. Painted Autumn? Painted Harvest. Painted Autumn. Painted. Autumn sweet with a painted harvest stamp set. I'm gonna double in check in the holiday catalog. This one is absolutely mm. gorgeous. It's got the designer paper here on the background, and the color combination is just really pretty. This one's actually got some Cajun craze with the crushed curry. Speaking of color combinations, this one really jumps out at you. It's Look got, at that! I know, very Oof. bright colors that colors that you probably wouldn't have originally thought. No, and yeah. to be honest with you, I mean, this is an artistic set. You can really have fun with it and really just step outside of that comfort zone and have some amazing fun with, with the colors and the textures going on here. And this one, just beautiful. I love, love the bright colors. Vicki said she had to miss a few minutes to run and answer the door for her stamping up order. <laughs> I hope it had this in the box. That's awesome. <laughs> She's opening it up right now so she can stamp along with us. Yes, Diana, you need to go back and order the punch. <laughs> oh, I know the punch is awesome. It really is. Here we've got another. This is another outside the, the box pink. color combination so here pretty. with the pinks. It's got some blush blossom and some powder pink together Ugh. and a little bit of crumb cake on it. See, just, and there's a sample I didn't do. Right? You and could so just even keep going. It just goes on and on and on. Now, this next one was one of my online classes when the holiday catalog um, preview was just demonstrators could get the stuff. I, I just did a quick um, online class with this one showing how to make the honeycomb background and how to stamp with this one. I did some crushed curry and some... Uh, soft suede for the the inside of the flower. This one I I, I just love love, is, love. This is I actually, love the depth that yeah, that one adds. Esther Esther made this. Oh, and the West I Milburn and just, never thought to put the old olive in the center. Yeah, how about See, that? Totally again, totally different. There you go. And it's just stunning, stunning. So here's another one. This one more traditional sunflower here with a crushed curry and the um, crumb cake in the center. That's pretty. And then it's got the um, the folder on the background. Now, this one here comes from Teresa Howe. Teresa's got some amazing work she out does. there. Stamp it, stamp it demo in our group, and she just comes out with some of these amazing projects. Here, she's got the crushed curry and a little bit of, I believe that's chocolate chip that she's got. And I love the angle cut. You did this in your class yeah. last Friday on yeah. Linda's online class, and it's just such a fun look. It, you know, Anything just, to shake it up a yeah. little bit, and that, that's really cool. It's just a simple, cool. simple little thing that you can do to really make your make your your focal points stand yeah. out on your card especially when you have a whole bunch of cards that really will draw your eye like oh that's a little different now this one and i'm gonna i'm gonna shake this up i'm gonna actually pick it up and make it a little dizzy <laughs> and see if the the um oh, it the, the camera will pick this up because it's got some wink of stella on the center Ooh. here if you can i don't know if the camera will pick that up but it in person it just makes it pretty jump out at you this is a, 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 a more classic sunflower look here. Beautiful, beautiful look. And then it's got some of that um, burlap cord in the background there. This is, what I, I'm, I'm drawing a blank on the name of that. The, the cord? The thick. I think it's burlap. Hold on. I'll tell you exactly, but I think it's burlap. <laughs> now here's Cording. a fun and different look to go with this, this set. And it is actually, um, what they did was there's... Jute um, twine. Jute twine. Thank you. Thank you. And here's <laughs> another strip of it on this card too. Soft suede, I'm sorry, we've got um, so saffron and uh, pool party and crumb cake together. And I then like what just took little strips and stamped it all at once and then just separated them to make that look. And it's just like a color block. Beautiful, beautiful effect there on that card. That's really pretty. Yeah. It's just, just different. Very simple. Very yeah. simple to do. Now, here's a fun fold. This one here uses the designer oh, paper. Of hearts on a that little last bit of sequin. Oh, yeah, look at it go. Yeah. Look at those hearts roll. Yeah. Here we've got the, the sunflower on the front, and then this is just a fun fold on the top here. Oh, I like that. Got a little that. banner underneath, and it's yeah, it's a great, great card there. Now this one, this is one of our, our favorites yeah. here. This came in our swap, <laughs> and um, it's actually, and I can't tell if that's silver. It, this might be the new um, foil, a champagne uh, foil. Champagne, yeah. And it's embossed with the wood texture embossing folder. Um, texture wise and then it's heat embossed with the other with gold, gold and, and copper 
Oh my god, that's it is stunning. 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 Yeah. Absolutely stunning. Now here it is combined with the um pumpkin oh drawing a blank on the name of the pumpkin dies here in the, the pumpkin set. Okay, here comes Linda with the catalog. Pick a pumpkin. Pick a pumpkin. And pattern pumpkin dies. And the and the pumpkin dies. So we've got the sunflowers growing out behind the pumpkins. Just another fun look to that. And um okay. I love this one. Love, love, love. So this one is, uh, this was another swap that came in. It's got the crushed curry center. It's got early espresso over the designer paper. You see the little strip of designer paper coming out from behind there. And let me see if I can find it. I actually started to case this set for um, my, my club this month. And then I went rogue, which so is not. I have to speak up. So the, the creator of this. Has just Christina, come on and Christina said is on. it is silver foil paper. Thank you. This is so Christina just, Miller's We want to make sure we give her a huge correct. shout out there. And thank you we so might, much uh, for creating such a gorgeous uh, yeah, card. Yeah, we're definitely going to be casing your card, Christina, because it's amazing. Over. But oh, I just wanted amazing. to jump in there. Sorry. Thank you. <laughs> thank you for that, Christina. This is why we love the lives, because yes. you guys are a part of it, and you can right. jump in you and help, help us out. Which DSP pack? So this what I did was, and I, 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 I started to case it, and then I went rogue. I pulled a Linda, and Yay. I went rogue. I know. I don't do it very often because I really love, I don't know. I'm just not as not as brave as Linda is. No. But then I, you know, I, I just I went like a little bit off the, the cuff and it had a lot of fun with it. And I love it. This one's more traditional with the curry and the olive and the espresso together and a bunch of banners die for the words there. Okay, now this one really, really goes Ooh. outside the box here for a Christmas card. Yeah. And we've got some real red and a couple different real red combinations here with, I think it's Daffodil Delight or Curry. I would go with Curry. Yeah. Of the flower there, but I mean, it's just such a pretty, and if you can look real close, you see that glitz jumping out gold. at you. I love doing that. Just, just a, a sliver. tiny little strip of that gold glimmer yeah. underneath the banner to, to really make it jump out at you but a fun way to make this set stretch it out beyond the fall and and bring it into christmas and this one uses the elements this one has the wooden elements that are also Ooh, in that yes. set here this one using some cajun craze and crumb cake together so another really pretty combination here a little strip of that designer paper on the background i love all these and this one actually uses the this is the sunflower cut out of that designer paper paper i love that right? paper gorgeous so it's got the paper on the background it's got a little bit of vellum here and then it's got the the flower is cut out of that designer paper for just another fun look there like a watercolored look here's some more cajun craze this time it's going with soft suede a little darker of the browns from the here was the other one here with the crumb cake so you can see the different variations. This one's a little softer. This one's very, very vibrant with the, the soft suede. And then it's got a little espresso paper too. So it's got, it's got two. And this one using the leaves in the, um, <laughs> oh, this one is not. <laughs> That's not in there. Which, is this pick a pumpkin? Um, oh my gosh. Okay. Scratch this. Yeah. Yeah. From a different set. <laughs> Surprise idea card. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. This one's from Gord Goodness. My oh, bad. There you my go. bad. We got it. We got it. There you we... go. <laughs> I'm looking at it going, really? Yeah, we got to jump in here. We got to jump in here from the Gord Goodness stamp set. We're going to take a break from the autumn, but not for long because now we've got this designer paper and this one. Um, Ooh, I love that on one. The background, it's got the, the crushed curry and the early espresso. That with background a bit of paper reminds me of corn. Yeah, it you does. Know, like it does. Cob. It does. Loving it. And here is some more. Um, this one with the, the flower and the designer paper. The striped, I love this. It's like watercolored designer paper here. We just get everybody excited about the other stamp set. They're like, I love the leaves. Ooh, the leaves. Okay, those, those leaves are from Gord Goodness. We had to jump in. We had to jump in in our box. Probably that was number 39. I we were 38 until that one came along. That made us, that jumped us up to 39. Sorry for the teaser for Gord Goodness, but, but it is a beautiful card. Yes. Another fall, beautiful fall card. Okay, so this one, again, using that same designer paper, but using the... The, the actual flowers for the top of it. So not just a different little look there with the design, two sheets of designer paper together on that one. And then we've got, whoops. Ooh, they just keep I coming. know because it's so awesome. You can't stop playing with it. Just like Linda said, it's yeah, addictive. It is. This one uses the stitch shapes in the center and here you can really see the wink of Stella mm. Ooh, and how beautiful that. it is on the, on the flower there. So 
Sometimes the camera doesn't always pick up that shimmer, but yeah. oh, in person, it's just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. This one also uses some Wink of Stella on our flower here, to that's on our main flower, to jump out. Now, here's a fun one with this card. This came from our swap here. <gasps> right? Look at that. Right? That's a fun fancy, fold. Fancy, fancy. Yeah. It's a fun little just fold out wow. there. Something a little different from your, your norm, and it really adds a little interest to the card. That's cool. I like that. Now, here we've got another really fall fall color here. It's got, this is Tangerine Tango. Mm -hmm. and, and and it's got a little bit of, a, it's on the mm -hmm. vanilla. It's got the designer paper. It's a, Ooh, a slightly I like different the way it cut opens. here. And then we've got, um, got a little tiny bit of Wink Stella, if I can get that to come out. There we go. On the camera, tiny bit of Wink Stella in the center, just to, to make it jump. Switching colors now. There's, see, there's some the blue. blue. Yeah, there's Isn't the blues sweet? like Linda was showing. And here it is in action. Again, this doesn't have to be a sunflower, no. and it doesn't have. I mean, when you're when you're creating and and and, and hand making art, it <laughs> doesn't even have to be real. No, you can go outside the box. You have permission. Yep. But this here is just such a beautiful, beautiful, stunning card. Yeah. And the the image and the colors pull it all together. It's got I love some the stitch. scallop yeah. behind it. That, that just really does is it. Awesome. The stitch shapes, circle die with the scallops on the background, and then it's got the matching. Baker's twine, the crushed curry Baker's twine on it. So here we've got a little lemon lime twist to jump out at you. It's got the designer paper on the background, and then we've got some vellum, a little touch of vellum there with some rhinestones, and the and the leaf in the front. I love that. It just really shows off the yeah. paper. Yeah, and the, I mean the lemon lime twist. And this is paper twist. to show off. Who knew the, that lemon lime twist would yeah. be so oh, fabulous? I love that I mean, color. Just now this one opens. I had to tape it shut, so you okay. want to flip it open. All right. We, sometimes you, what you have to do to, to photograph, photograph a card. We will have <laughs> pictures of these on our blogs yes. following the episode about an hour later, yeah. as, as well as the color charts. Yeah. But yeah, I have to do that too. Isn't that cute? The top open. And I was just holding it up so you can see the, the Wink of Stella yeah. on there. Lots of Wink of Stella here to really make them jump. This is gorgeous. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. And we have another one here. I love this one. It's another again, one with the scallop. Another, yeah, and, and, and more designer paper. So again, stitch shapes with the scallop circle. On the circles, framelit dies, the layering circles. And vellum. And, and vellum is vellum. really, vellum. really in with yes. the stamp set. It yes. just is fantastic. I literally have just bought like three or four packs of vellum because I'm finding I'm Love using it everywhere it. like that. Circles and... Yeah, it's fantastic. And then this pumpkin is cut out from the designer paper. So that little accent. Yeah. So here's another really simple, fun one. It's got a little random stamping on the background. It's got a little bit of the, the gold glitz on it from the glimmer, the gold glimmer paper. And just different colors. Yeah. Yeah, going outside the box with the colors. And then back to fall. Back to fall with this one, designer paper. We've got the punch in there and the and the sayings. I love this little, this the stripy designer paper here mixed together Yeah. for a fun focal point there on that card. This one is just stunning. Just stunning. It's yeah. got the, yeah. the, the sunflower designer paper on the background. It's got the, um, and the vanilla is, is texture embossed with the, the leaf. Leaves, I think. The leaves yeah. folder that I'm drawing a blank on the name. But the leaves were punched out of vellum. Hold that up to vellum cool so you can see. I know that vellum is just everywhere. It's so in with the set. It's fantastic. I'm looking for the embossing folder. Make sure we're saying the right name. Yeah. So this layered concludes... Layered leaves. Layered thank leaves. Thank you. Layered leaves on that embossing, embossing folder. So this concludes our 39 samples. <laughs> <laughs> Really, that was a stunning amount of fantastic cards here. Again, these samples will be on our blogs about an hour after the live. Yes. You'll be able to see them all there. I don't even know that Look I at can, that. I was saying, and please don't comment, <laughs> like, I counted there were 32. 30, yeah, no, I don't no, want, we didn't. There yeah. were 38. So in, our, sorry, in, our heart, in our world, in our world, we want it to be 39, 39 because it's episode 39. 39. <laughs> yes. yes, don't burst our bubble, please. Right, I know, I know. We, we, did, we did a quick, like, brrr. Okay, we think this close to 39, we're going with it. <laughs> if only Tammy and I had the power to make vellum go on back order. <laughs> oh, my gosh, right, right? Let's see if we can make that movement happen. Okay, so we have just shared so much with you and now it's time for us to give back to where'd you. i put them all so we have so many prizes to give away right now if you have left a comment here on on one of these lives you will be entered to win and um we're gonna pop down here to our drop our giveaway screen 
which is right here. And um, because I had to do a restart, I want to make sure that we get the right. Oh, and we have to log uh, back in. So that is I want to make sure that we get the right um, post that I'm pulling from, and not the one that that we had to restart on. So bear with me for one second. <laughs> okay, I think I have them all. <laughs> Carol, that is the beauty of Facebook Live. This video is up there forever. She's like, she lost us for a second. Oh yeah, go back and watch some of it. Yeah, absolutely. The beautiful thing about this is you can do that. If this video will be on here forever, as well as once we get it on YouTube, it'll be up there forever too. And again, you can click on the click on the link in the video's descriptions on either YouTube or Facebook, and it will bring you to the resource pages. All right, we're going to start our giveaways. Okay, um, get your names this on. This is all people. coming from the comments. So we're starting with the Feather Together stamp set. Feather Together. together. There it is, Feather Together. <laughs> and the winner is... Good luck, everyone. See, now they get to watch me be like, what's the name? <laughs> I, I can't see it. <laughs> so that one is Ooh. Lisa Ellie. E L Y and um, congratulations, Lisa! If you are a winner of one of our prizes, be sure to fill out that prize claim form. You have two weeks to claim your prize, or it goes back in the prize vault. And all of these are unclaimed prizes. Yes, they are. So, so this, is this one is Thankful Life. Thankful Life, which is last year's Hostess stamp yeah. set. Can't even buy this one. Could never buy it, but can't even get it anymore. Very rare set. This one goes to Debbie, and it's R E N S I N K Rensink. R E N S I N K Rensink. Rensink. All right, so next up is that wrong. Uh, Gift the Gift of, of Love, Love, another hostess set from last year, and that one goes to April at Mon M O H N. Congratulations! And next up, we have paper pumpkin kits. So we'll start with the I believe it's May, the May Sprinkles of Life, which was the donut set and a tote bag. Sprinkles of Love. There we go. So it's Stick the, it in the bag. The, the paper full paper pumpkin, brand new kit, and. Um, and we've got a tote bag to go along with it. And the winner of that is Penny, Penny Freeman. Freeman or Pen Freeman, Penny Freeman from Houston. Love you. Houston. Oh yeah. Houston. And our next one is go, it's the July paper pumpkin kit and a matching tote. And that one is it's the positively picturesque. That was the window cards. Oh yeah. Kit. And that one goes to Debbie Maybe. Fitzgerald Boone. Congratulations. So congratulations. Hold on. Oh, wait, wait. We're not done. We're not We're done. Not We're not done. done. Hold on. Yeah, this is the this it's... is one of the best. Uh, they're all great, right? Hold on, I'm still scribbling. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> so this is uh the card kit. And this was actually a current card kit. This is, uh, this is oh, happy day oh, card happy kit. Day. oh happy day card oh, kit. Oh happy day. And it is oh happy day. It is this one goes to Kendra. Bon, B O E H N E. Congratulations, Kendra, and make sure everybody fills out the prize claim form. So, we have one more prize, and that is our after live prize. That is for the complete Carols of Christmas bundle. That is the dies and the stamp set. That winner will be drawn live on our um, September 26th. Uh, episode, which is episode 40 of the oh, Stampin' Scoop 40! Show. Can you believe, can you believe it? Oh my it? goodness. Yeah, I know. Wow. It's like the oh, it flies. Yeah. You know? I can't believe it. And every, every episode packed <laughs> filled with fun. <laughs> fun, yeah. silliness, fun, gremlins. Fun, silliness, technical <laughs> difficulties. It's all part of the fun. It's all, it's how we it still goes. love it. We still love it. All right, guys. Well, thanks for joining us today. We will see you back here on September 26th, which is the day Two after weeks. my birthday. <gasps> mm -hmm. We're going to have to have a birthday yeah. party. Yeah. Yeah. Presents. Presents, please. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm so kidding. All right, guys. Have a great day, and we will see you back here on the 26th. Thanks for joining us.